just woke up at 10 o'clock this morning because we did not get home until like 1.30 because mom was being a wonderful person. But it was good to celebrate with Lexi. We wish we could have stayed out longer, but that's just, um, it's not really our scene. So now we are going to get some breakfast or just coffee. Are we going to Starbucks? We're going to go to Starbucks and get some coffee. And then we're going to head down to the strip with my parents and Sophia, which should be a good time. Emily and I just got ourselves some Starbucks. How was it, love? Well, actually, I didn't get Starbucks. Just Emily got Starbucks. She got herself a croissant and some sort of beverage. Ooh, now we're walking over to the mall because we're waiting on my parents. You made a mistake letting your mom here that you were going to the mall. She tried to meet us later at like one. Yeah, but, but we didn't tell her we were going to the mall. We just said we were going to hang out for a minute. So we told her we were in the mall, they never would have come down. And then we would not go to the strip today. Well, we would have just left them. They could have gotten a taxi. Rude. <laughs> a taxi is expensive. No, like 50 bucks. Well, cheaper than what an Uber was probably for me. Uber. But now we're going to walk to the mall and uh, hang out for a little bit. Yes. Emily and I found, stumbled upon, really. A farmer's market. Yeah, it was pretty cool. They had like these chairs that had like little wine things on them. Too bad we didn't bring our U-Haul with us this ah, trip. Someone also asked to clean Emily's glasses. Yeah, that was weird. It's free. I was like, no thanks. What do you think that's a demonstration for? His glasses cleaner. Yeah, farmer's market. I don't know, that's weird. Mm -hmm. They're also selling corn, which... Yeah, I was like, Austin, how much do you think that is? So expensive. <laughs> Fresh corn imported from Indiana. <laughs> They have a lot of vegetables and fruits where I was like, there's no way that that grows here. We're in a desert. Well, they probably get it from California, right? Well, and how is it really a farmer's market? Well, it's like that one in Minneapolis, right? That my parents go to. Yeah. And they sell like grapes. They have corn there in the middle of winter. <laughs> Strange. We are inside the Venetian Hotel in like the shopping area, which is really pretty. We had a whole thing getting lunch. We had to go to like four different places. It was it was pretty intense, but we went to Royal Britannia. It was really good. Emily and I are back at the hotel room. Ouch! You sat on my foot! So I sat on Emily's foot. The Venetian was quite busy, so after lunch we ended up going back pretty soon. Now we're taking a bit of a respite, just kind of relaxing for a little bit, and then uh, we're going to go out and have some dinner. Well, we're also going to get a few drinks with the gym. Oh, a few drinks with the gymster. Sounds like it's going to be a fun night. Emily got tired of waiting of me because I've been working too long, even though I've only been working for 30, 45 minutes. She thought today was my day off, but... I have a feature film next month, so I don't really have the luxury day off. I mean, I should, because we're on vacation, and I should hang out with Emily Moore. And she's 100% right, it's just, there's a lot going on right now. So she went down to the bar. I'm supposed to be down there in a couple of minutes, and I, I think I, I actually will. I'm going to be as good as I can about meeting her as soon as possible. It's just, it's just a lot to do. So as anyone who has ever watched the vlog before knows, I'm not good at handling stress, like, at all. Today was no exception. You see, while attempting to upload my vlog, I thought I would check some emails, and so I checked my school emails and learned that my Spanish class, which I thought wasn't starting for another two weeks, starts tomorrow, which isn't great. Now, as the viewers of the vlog probably know, I have never been good at Spanish, and I probably shouldn't even pass my last Spanish course, but I did and did okay, and not having to start for another couple of weeks was nice, but on top of that, I had another problem. You see, the stress from finding that I had to take another Spanish class, like, almost immediately made me go on to Butler's homepage and see what the syllabus would look like, but I couldn't log in, and I tried again, and again, and again, and again, and I just couldn't log in. Now this went on way longer than it probably should have, and I was about this close to having a panic attack, and I went downstairs to try to 
just forget about it, which I didn't and probably irritated Emily and Jimmy. But after much ado about, well, nothing, if we're being completely honest, I did eventually log in, but with a lot of stress. Now there's a certain relief that comes with doing it, but I know that was being ridiculous. And I apologize to Emily and Jimmy and the world, but it's, it's just who I am. We are at the mall. We decided to drive here because it was too long. Oh, yep. And Sophia went swimming. And I was swimming with Kimmy. That's right. So now we drove to the mall because it was too far of a walk. <laughs> and it's pretty hot. So we did go at the sushi place first. So now we're going to the sushi place.